Hello, I am Sri from CBTU. Welcome to the Ethical Hacker Training Course based on CEH Certification Program by EC Council. Module System Hacking Section Hacking Methodology. Hacking methodology is no unique step by step process but usually follow some standard steps. Uh, there will be a pre attack phase and attack phase in hacking. In pre attack phase, we will be having Footprinting and reconnaissance, scanning and enumeration is done in pre-attack phase. Pre-attack phase is like preparing a battleground, gearing up for the winning battle. Collect all the information about the organization by whatever possible means. And the information is like IP ranges, network mapping, infrastructure topology, security policies, hosting environment, and uh, key employees information, vulnerabilities, etc. Analyze, scan, map, conclude on the data readiness for attacking. In pre-attack, blueprint of the organization security profile through various tools and techniques is prepared. Hacking phase. The application of what is discovered during the pre-attack phase. Gaining access to operating system, application, network level, etc. by cracking passwords. Escalation of privilege to gain full access. Execute apps, install rootkits, planting trojans, backdoors, maintaining backdoor access, erase evidence, clearing tracks, logs, documentation, reporting the activity project undertaken. Footprinting reconnaissance is the investigation and the survey of target evaluation. Scanning and enumeration. This is to collect all the information about the target. Ping sweep, port scan, vulnerability scanning, network mapping is done as part of this scanning. And this uses the information that is collected during the reconnaissance phase. The fine grain information includes IP ranges, network mapping, infrastructure topology, security policies, hosting environment, key employee information, vulnerabilities, etc. Hacking phase is the application of what is discovered during the pre-attack phase. Hacking phase begins by gaining access by cracking passwords, escalation of privilege, executing apps, planting trojans, backdoors, maintaining backdoor access, arising evidence, clearing tracks, logs, and documenting the entire activity. Hacker uses all hacking tools and attacks the system to gain access. Techniques include buffer overflows, session hijacking, password tracking to gain access. Hacker explores the target system. Gain access at operating system level, app level and network level. Password cracking is the process of recurring passwords from data that have been stored in or transmitted by a system. A common approach brute force attack is to try guesses repeatedly for the password and check them again as the available cryptographic hash of the password. The purpose of password cracking may be to help a user recover forgotten password, gain unauthorized access to a system, test strength of the password security. Hacker might have gained access with standard privileges and he works further to obtain administrator privileges for complete access. Hacker wants to revisit the target after gaining access, to maintain backdoor access, to gain and keep unauthorized remote access to a computer, malwares are installed on the compromised target. Install malware like backdoors, rootkits, trojans to warn the system. Once a target is in hacker's control, hacker can transfer the files, manipulate data, apps, configurations, etc. The purpose of a backdoor is to maintain exclusive communication channel and control the compromised host at will. Backdoors is a method of bypassing the normal authentication and are often used for securing remote access to a system. A backdoor may take the form of a hidden part of a program one uses or it can be a separate program as well. The purpose of a backdoor is to maintain exclusive communication channel and control compromised host at will. Backdoors are designed to support file transfer, file execution, logging of the keystrokes and control of connections.
Back Office 2000 was designed as a backdoor. The server runs on Windows and there are clients for Windows, Linux and other operating systems. A rootkit is a malicious software designed to enable unauthorized access to a system, masking its identity and existence. It can hide its files, its process, its registry entries and its port in multiple DLLs. Hacker Defender HXDEF is an open source rootkit for Windows. Hacking is unauthorized access and attacker erases all evidences, clears logs, hides malicious files to get his attack unnoticed. By clearing tracks, intelligently stay undetected, remove evidences, logs, visible changes to escape unhurt and avoid legal action. Thanks for watching.